Birdie is Alan Parker's fourth film to be selected for Cannes, an event which he sees as an important showcase for his work, although one of his earlier pictures, Midnight Express, received a hostile reception. This year, Birdie, by pleasing contrast, won a ten-minute standing ovation after its screening at the Palais. I talked to Alan Parker and Messrs Modine and Cage, and to begin with, asked the director why he'd chosen to make this film. The book, really, I've sent the book in manuscript form uh, five or six years ago. And I always thought that it would be a great film, but I had no idea how to do it then. Uh, and then, as the years went by, I got a bit more confident, a bit more arrogant, as you know. Uh, so I thought I could have a go at doing it, and that's really... But it was, it was really the inspiration of the book. Nicholas, tell me something about the character you played, because I gather you went to enormous lengths to create the part. Well, uh, not necessarily enormous lengths, but it was just a phase I was going through at the time to explore that kind of approach to acting, which was to physically make demands on myself to connect to my character. And really all I did was I kept the bandages on and I pulled my teeth out. That's a bit my, drastic, isn't well, it? Well, the teeth so. will come back down again. They were baby teeth. It's not as big a deal as people seem to think it is, because they had to do it anyway. It was just good timing. Are they coming down now? They will come down when back from France. I've, I've forgotten how young you were to have baby teeth. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, Matthew, how, how did you manage to get the rapport between the three of you? I don't know. I, I was just saying last night that it feels like we're, we're three chemicals that, that don't mix well right now. But during the film, I, Alan thought that maybe it was, it was because of the, uh, the, the situation, that the, that the story is so much more important than, than personal feelings that, that, uh, that they overcame the kind of problems that, that we might have working together. And, because the story was so important, I think you just put those things aside and, and uh, you know work for the the, the, the film, and the, the story. And that's the most important thing. Sure. I think that the contrast between the three of us actually helped to make the film that was that had arrived in the end. Uh, because uh, it's you know it's like two stones when you rub them together they make a spark. And we were in our contrasting, we were coming up with its own sort of. We had our own baby so to speak.